I'm Claude Kelly. Yeah. And I'm Chuck Harmony. And we're a band called Lewis York. Yeah. As well as songwriter and producer to the stars. <laughs> I went to Berkeley, I chose music business as my major, knowing that it would lead me to a job. And even then I still wasn't really paying attention and didn't become a songwriter until after I graduated from Berkeley out of sheer necessity. I, I didn't start into college too just with the concept of music being a career, but at that point it was, I wanted to be a jazz piano player. This um, rap producer, he heard the, the little tracks that I would make to improvise, do my jazz solos on top of, and he was like, yo, you mind if I use that? And he used it for this, this group um, called Dirty that was signed to Universal. And so, that was, my, I got my first check from that. My first break was with an, an artist named Frankie J, signed to Columbia, but it was actually through DJ Clue. And he saw some talent in me and he hired me to do a remix to a, a record mm. um, for Ray J, Brandy's little brother. And he got called to work on Frankie J and he called me and that was my introduction to record labels and artists. We, Chuck and I tend to get artists at a place where they need to be prove themselves. Which is a cool place to be because then, then it's like sink or swim. And what they get from us is the courage to be themselves. It's, it it's all has to be meaningful. And so for me, I, I want the artist to really have something to say to their fan base. But if you can find something about that's genuine to you and make that the pop hit, then you'll want to sing it forever. People will be attached to it forever and it'll also be like an actual learning, growing experience for you. Some of the, the crazy concepts that I had or crazy ideas that I had for music, I, could, I wouldn't be able to express them unless I did it myself. And so Lewis York is definitely about me expressing myself totally. I think it's also easy to think of like two successful musicians who start a band to, to kind of see it as a side project and it's, it's completely the opposite. Um, we're trying to shatter what you know about us already with better things. So the records that we've done that people know us for, we're very, very proud of. And they're the building block that taught us how to be lean and mean about create creativity and performing and stuff. But Lewis York and Weirdo Workshop and everything that's coming out of this is all of that on steroids because we've, we learned from the best. What's up, y'all? This is B.O.B. This is G-Eazy. I'm Mo. This is Julia Michaels. This is Logic. Make sure you subscribe to the Recording Academy channel. Flex.